Hey, how's it going guys? My name is Dom and welcome to today's video where we're gonna have a look at logical assignments within JavaScript, all right? So this technique right here, I learned fairly recently and it's actually quite useful for eliminating lines of code. So it's gonna let you reassign your variables depending on a certain condition. So essentially, you're gonna be able to avoid using if statements in certain situations, okay? So it's gonna be much easier to explain this through some code. So Let's jump into it right now by firstly assigning a new variable called a equal to a value of 10 and then gonna hop down here then just say console.log the value of a so now we're gonna reassign a using logical assignment. So we're gonna have a look at three different types of logical assignment in today's video. The first type is gonna be using and okay so right down here we're gonna say a then say and and equal to then we're going to say 20 so this right here is going to be your logical assignment all right so this right here this is saying look if a is a truthy value if it's currently a truthy value then reassign it to be 20 okay because 10 is a truthy value we're going to see that reassignment therefore this console log is going to give us 20. if i go inside the browser here we get 20 right there okay so to sum it up with an if statement, this line of code is doing this. It's doing if a, then a equal to 20. If a is truthy, then hop down here and reassign that value. So it's gonna take this if statement and put it in a single line. So um, that is your logical assignment right there. If I make something, sorry, if I make a something like zero, so of course zero is a falsy value, therefore this time, it's gonna say no, zero is not a truthy value, therefore let's keep it the way it is and skip this 20. Back in the browser and it stays at zero. Other falsy values is gonna be things like empty string, uh, you know, things like, uh, let's just do like uh, undefined or, you know, null, things like that. They're all falsy values, so of course, you know, uh, it's not gonna be reassigned to be 20. So. Let's have a look at the second uh, sort of uh, type of logical assignment in today's video. That's gonna be using the OR operator. So this here is gonna be, you know, um, the opposite really. It's just saying, look, if A is a falsy value, then reassign to be 20. This one here is probably gonna be your most used out of the three, um, just because um, it's gonna let you do things like set defaults, okay? So this right here, of course, a is gonna stay at 20 because you know it's currently uh, not a falsy value. So back in the browser, it's gonna stay at 10, right? So if I make A a falsy value, something like zero, it's gonna say, yep, A is a falsy value, therefore let's reassign it to be 20. And this is where things like your default values and you know that default assignment is gonna you know, be uh, quite useful here. Okay, and the last type is gonna be your nullish uh, logical assignment. So this one here is gonna use your double question marks and this is very similar to the previous falsy version but this one is gonna be a little bit stricter in that it's gonna look for null or undefined. So this right here, this zero is actually fine. So it's gonna keep that zero. Back in the browser, we can see it keeps zero, okay? But now if I make this undefined, in lowercase, there we go. Um, now it's gonna say, yep, look, A is undefined, therefore make it 20, back in the browser, and it goes to 20. The same thing's gonna work for null, and that's about it. So of course, null, it's also gonna change to 20. So that is your logical assignment within JavaScript. Hope you guys learned something in today's video. If you did, drop a like and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video.